Welcome to my channel. I'm having a great day today, guys. So I decided to take a bunch of your comments, which all had to do with the same thing, and make a video. And that video is, how do you close the knife? You all do these crazy tricks, you know, and then you, you end it on an open knife, and how do I close it? So I'm going to show you multiple ways to close the knife from multiple positions. So I'm going to show you five closings. Three of the closings are going to be from this position to closed, and two are going to be from this position to closed. Okay, so pretend you're doing a trick, you know, you're going, combo, woo. Okay, and you land like in this position right here. You're like, how do I close the knife? The first move I'm going to show you is how to close it with a double rollout, but it's go a double rollout to close position. So you're going to flick it out, back, and around, like that. And it's going to be going this way, if you're right-handed. You're having the bite handle go back, and then come around like this. So you see how I went back on the back of my knuckles, and then I, I twisted it around back to the front, and then I go out like that with the blade out and then I go up and it lands like this. The second closing is exactly like the first one but it's the opposite direction. It's going this way. It's basically a reverse double rollout. It's gonna look like this and it's pointed away from you. The other one was pointed towards you at the end. This one's pointed away. For the second one you're gonna have the handle go back just like the first one but you're gonna fling the whole knife forward around and down like that. So it's easier to do it in slow motion. So you're going back, then you're going forward and down. And you're having your thumb clasp the bite handle like that. So the third closing is going to look like this. You're going to flick the bite handle back around your fingers just like the first two, but you're going to get your pointer finger out and put it on the back of the safe handle. So see how that's the safe handle? And then your other fingers are going to look like this. So your thumb and your pointer finger are right there. Then you're going to flick the handle back like that. And you still have your pointer finger there, and so it's horizontal to your body. And then you're going to use these fingers to pivot the knife really slowly around. And you get your thumb, and you go down like that. So the knife's pointed down and you go up. So it's going to land like this. See how the other two landed like this, and this one lands like this. The fourth closing is the opposite of the basic twirl and the closing for it. So the video's up above. I think I might have shown this in the video. But basically you're in this position instead of this position, and you're, pr you're trying to close it. So what you're going to do is you have your fingers like that. You're going to ha have your fingers on the safe handle, let the bite handle swing back around and then you're going to have your, your two fingers like this. So do you see the motion I just did? I went down and then I put my middle finger here so this is holding it and then I went around like that. And then I'm going to grab this whole handle with all my, hand, my fingers. This, this is the safe handle. I'm going to grab it with all my fingers. 
I'm gonna go back again and up and then I'm gonna land in this position okay here's the final closing that I'm gonna show you it's probably the toughest it's honestly one of my favorite things to incorporate and it's usually how I end my combos unless I'm doing a crazy aerial. You're gonna be in this position right here with the knife pointed down and pretend you do a crazy combo that lands you in this position. So you're gonna be holding your whole hand on the safe handle, right? It's because you're gonna let this handle drop. So you have your whole hand on the safe handle and you're letting this handle drop, okay? And then you're twisting, you're twisting this in your hand. So you see how my thumb is twisting the safe handle, right? And you twist it all the way around like that. You move your hands out of the, your fingers out of the way, these fingers, and you go up and you're going to land in this position. This is also the fastest closing I can think of. So you're in this position. You remember to put a looser grip on these fingers right here. Let this go down. Twist the whole thing in your hand and go up. Yeah, so once you get that down really fast, it'll start going from this to that. And so you'll be swinging around like that and going up. Swinging around. And then you can open and close it from that. I want to give a quick shout out to all my Patreons. Thank you so much. I just made another tier, tier 4, and there's already one person part of it. Um, it's really cool. You get two sessions a month with me um, to learn tricks if you need some extra help. for watching guys please like subscribe and comment below or you can dm me on instagram my instagram is right here and i will be happy to answer your questions within two or three weeks